We want to talk now about the growing problem of wild hogs in Oklahoma. Joining us now is our Extension Wildlife Specialist, Dwayne Elmore. And Dwayne, it's really gotten a lot worse in the last few years. Yeah, um, wild pigs have spread across most of the state now. Uh, they have traditionally were along the Red River to our, to our south, but uh, most counties have pigs and we're getting a lot more complaints about them, even up into Kansas now. Okay. Give us an idea of, of some of the problems that wild pigs can cause for landowners. Sure. One of the most frustrating things is they root a lot for food in the soil, um, so they'll tear up pastures and also get into streams and cause sedimentation problems and sometimes erosion. And they also eat a lot of uh, native plants, so they're, they're a competitor with not only livestock but also wildlife species. And then there's disease transmission issues. They carry several diseases that are transmissible to uh, cattle, to uh, a domestic pig, and also potentially humans. I know that you and, and a lot of our Extension colleagues from around the state are getting questions, so we're gearing up to do some educational efforts and kind of help landowners through the process of, of dealing with the issue of wild hogs. Mm -hmm. Tell us about what you have planned. Well. Um, OSU Extension has partnered with the Noble Foundation and also with Mississippi State University Extension and we're hosting a workshop in uh, Osage County and this is at the uh, in Pawhuska at the fairgrounds the Ag building on February 15th and that starts at 9 o'clock and we're going to cover the basic biology of feral pigs how to control them what the laws and regulations are and also what are some potential disease implications. Okay so really a a wide range there and if somebody's interested in attending they need to RSVP for that? Yeah there's no charge but we're providing lunch so we'd like to know how many people to plan for and they can just contact me uh, preferably before February 8th so to give us about a week. Okay yeah. sounds like they'll be exposed to some good information and we'll kind of get this conversation started on SUNUP as well and try to help people out with this situation. Yeah. Okay Dwayne Elmore thanks a lot. And for more information on that meeting to address wild hogs in Osage County, you can just go to our website, sunup.okstate.edu.